What's going on, YouTube? Did you miss me? It's your guy, Mr. DCYLP. Hey, check this out. I'm designing some slides, y'all. Designing some slides. I'm in the market. All right, so I'm in, I'm once again I'm in that stalls cab works live uh, free. Yeah, I said free design editing software. All right, so we're gonna make a few mock up of some slides. All right, I'm gonna show y'all how to get this done. All right, right after my intro. Okay, so like I said, I'm in the market for some slides. Let me just change this background to transparent. I'm in the market for some slides and I was playing around with this earlier. So I said, you know what? Let me show my people how I'm getting this thing done, all right? Let me show my people how they can design their own slides if they want to, all right? So as I always say, I always get my mock-ups from Google. So if y'all don't believe me, this one right here that I'm moving around, I got this from Google, okay? All I did, as you can see, all I did was I typed in men's sandal clip art and all these particular different styles of sandals popped up, all right? Now, this is this, this style right here is a style that I like to wear. So, I downloaded it, okay? It's the most, it's the most um, comfortable style of slide that I, uh, that I prefer, per se, and I buy all of mine from Adidas. Okay, so why not just design and try to get my own made to the same specifications as the one that I wear from Adidas, okay? But with my own logo on them, okay? So let me go back into CadWorks Live. All right, so I'm just gonna take this, what I started, and just drop it down here somewhere and start from scratch with you guys, okay? I'm not really done with the design right here. I was just playing around with it. If I'm going to design this slide and actually put it out, I want it to be more so uh, like a unisex style so men and women can wear it. But I don't want it to be too, you know, over the top, you know, uh, flamboyant to the point, you know, where, you know, men ain't going to want to rock it. But then I don't want it to be too you know, dull to the point where, you know, women ain't gonna want to rock it. So we gotta, you know, we gotta find like that happy medium, y'all. All right, so let's just start, okay? So select it. So first of all, you gotta download the image, which I already did, so I'm not gonna go back over that with y'all. Download the image from, um, from, um, from Google. Once you download it, you gotta go over here and vectorize it, okay? I can't, I'm not gonna vectorize it because you know what yeah i just i just start all over so you guys can see it from scratch okay i'm just gonna import over here import it into cadworks live as you can see it has the white background we don't want that white background because we can't design we can't recreate and add stuff to it if that white background's there okay so we gotta vectorize it so we go over here to the left column column and click on convert to vector okay it says you got to choose your background color okay so the background color is white go to next now it says the foreground colors all we want is this black outline so click on the area where you can just grab that black and just click on next okay that's all we need right there okay now we just click okay and as you can see the white background is gone. Okay, just like the one I already pre I had already. All right, so I don't need. Uh, yeah, I just dropped this one down here just in case we need it later. Okay, so as you, it, everything's pretty much together right now. It's solid. You know, if you click on it, and you click and you pick one of these colors over here to the right, the whole slide is just gonna turn that color. But we want to break it up. So let me just show y'all. See, see how it changed to brown and just a line, red, yellow. We don't want that. Okay, let's just go back to black. We're gonna break this thing apart. So come up top, 
and you go to shaping and you scroll down here to this money sign where it says break apart by curves click on that and as you can see now let me blow it up some as you can see now each section is its own entity so I can click on this and just turn this to brown if I wanted to okay or I can just click on the soul and, and change that to red each one of these single pieces I can change to whatever color I want okay if you click on the whole the outline of the, of the shoe you change that to black look at that look at that all right now we got other pieces in here too don't forget we got a piece in here somewhere and we got a piece in here that we that we could pick as well so we're gonna pick this change that to red pick this change that to red all right now now if you guys wanted to add anything extra to it like as far as like words or what have you come over here add text and let me just throw something in real quick let's go with unfamous okay My unfamous design Here we go. Let's say I wanted the unfamous to sit right there. On the side of the soul. Look at that. And let's say we wanted we wanted it to be like embossed or whatever. So now we just go to let's go to clip art. I'm gonna pick horizontals horizontals just grab this line where did, where did the line go lost it oh here it is grab this line right select this just go to duplicate all we're going to do is change the words anyways duplicate And when we submit this to our manufacturer, we're just gonna let them know that we want that in embossed. All right, so now they know that these words right here on the side, we want those embossed. All right, now let's say we wanted to put something over here words or whatever we can start from scratch with with add text but i just like to just duplicate what i already have and just change the wording okay well since we're going with an unfamous i'm just going to change the font i don't like that font right there let's go with something else uh, these are just the basic fonts, y'all. Grab a let me grab a basic font real quick, just so y'all can see. All right, let's go with that. Have it. We could throw it right here. We could throw it down bottom, or let's change the color. Ooh, that green. change the color and throw it across the strap like this okay stretch it out stretch all right make sure everything's lined up Now, our slide is pretty much coming together. 
now once again just to show the manufacturer what you want you could just duplicate this duplicate the wording and just say okay that you want that embossed as well or if you want it screen printed or uh, sublimated or I don't know whatever style of freaking uh, font or material you want you just write make sure you write everything on the um, on the image so that your manufacturer has a reference of what you really want all right now let's say you wanted let's say you wanted this to be like leather a leather strap up here you can also put emboss and add just to the wording like leather leather strap you know and this is all for this is all just for you know references for when it comes to you know the time where you're getting everything put together now the manufacturer has a better idea of what you want now let's say you wanted to change this strap into like some funky pattern or design go to texture pick the texture you want if you don't already have it in your uh, in your file you can just download something or purchase something that always works. Purchase like a funky pattern. Let me just scroll through, see what I got here. Uh, let's pick. Uh, let's pick this one. Yeah, see now that's hard. That <laughs> whoo! That came out pretty hard. But now you can't really see the unfamous words. So what I could do is change the color. Change it to white. There you go, man. There you go. A little quick tutorial on how you can design some custom slides for you and your brand. All right. So once again, before this video ends, make sure you hit that thumbs up. Make sure you hit that bell notification so you never miss anything. And make sure, man, you tell somebody about me, man. Tell somebody about me. Keep spreading the word, y'all. I'm almost at 2,000 subscribers. And um, everybody that's coming through, you know, viewing getting this valuable information and not subscribing shame on you i know y'all coming because i got analytics baby i know y'all coming through viewing so what's stopping you from subscribing huh let me know all right let me know how y'all guys feel about this uh tutorial let me know if uh i should put any either one of these designs out you know like i said nothing's finalized i was just playing around but I am gonna come up come up with something official that I really want and um end up getting a sample made and take it from there. Alright, till next time. Like I always say, I hope you're working hard on your brand. And that's it for this one, y'all. Skitty. The message is always in the cloth, the colors, the designs, the fit. Basically, pay attention, stay alert, and remember, choose your own path.